This is an ESTS Logiclave 300 litre vertical closing autoclave. It's the largest one of the range. The lab it's going into is a water testing lab. Predominantly the filters that go through the water testing procedures need to be sterilised before they're used. The operator will come to the machine with their filters, load the machine, the door will close pneumatically. And when the cycle starts, it pulls a vacuum within the chamber. And when it hits a certain set point, it'll inject steam into the chamber to mix the steam and the air together. Then it'll pull the steam and the air out again and keep repeating this process until all the air is diluted and there's pure steam. And that pure steam, we can then control the temperature within the chamber at a given pressure. We should have, with no air in the chamber, around 136 degrees C. And we're looking for sterility to be over 134 for the minimum of three minutes to make sure that everything that comes out of the chamber is sterile. When we press start on the touch screen, and it will open this the exhaust valve, start the vacuum pump. When it hits 100 millibar, it'll open steam valve. So when the, the steam goes into the chamber, it hits its um, set point, and then the steam valve will close, the exhaust valve will open, and it will pull the, pull the steam and air out of the chamber through the vacuum pump. It comes um, through a plate and a frame heat exchanger, which um, condenses down the steam, so the vacuum pump can pull it out and put it down the drain. And then when it's got to its set point, it'll then close the exhaust valve, open the steam valve again, inject steam back into the chamber, and repeat that process um, until there's no air left in the chamber. All the valves on this machine are from Burkitt. We find them to be a high quality valve um, at the right price. We're limited on space on, on this footprint, so to get um, 14 valves on this machine, having a small actuator head um, helps us. We're also on the um, angled seat valves. Burkitt provided with a male thread on the outside, which saves us on fittings and saves us on space. We've got the machines out there with them on, they've probably been on there two or three years and they've never been changed, so that's you know so we don't have any issues. <laughs>